So in this video, I want to briefly talk about this pencil. It's called the Metacell Light or the Metacell Light Knock. And basically it's a cheaper version of the Metacell No Sharpen pencil, which is a uh, pencil we've talked about a few times on the channel, it's this right here. And it has this metallic tip, like metal cell, metal pencil. And uh, this is good for uh, something like as long or longer than a standard pencil, but it's just this little replaceable tip and it never needs to be sharpened. It eventually will wear out, but uh, it's a no sharpen pencil. This is about, I think, say $15 and it has a metal uh, you know, body and then a little replaceable tip here. The light version is retractable. It's uh, clearly has a knock on it. It looks like a pen, full rubberized grip, but it has a very similar tip to it. This is the, uh, the light version and it costs about maybe seven or $8 as opposed to $15. So about half the price, but essentially the same amount of writing length. They say it's five kilometers. I think it's a little bit longer for the full version, but quite similar. So we have the two here. This, uh, this version, no eraser, replaceable tip. It looks like this it has a little uh, brass or metal thread there. And then this is the writing component to it. And that's really it. The body itself is some sort of metal. It's fairly heavy. heavy. I don't think it's stainless steel, uh, but you know, it's not quite that heavy, but it's got some heft to it. The Metasil light version, again, for about half the price, you get clear plastic clip, looks pretty good, retractable knock style button, full rubberized grip, nothing, uh, nothing special over here. It's just uh, part of the same, you know, same diameter and all that, no grip material, but it is fully rubberized the whole length of the way. You can see the contour of the writing piece is slightly different. It's a little bit blunter than the, uh, the other version. Here's the two next to each other. And this is the refill. So basically it looks exactly like the refill of a ballpoint pen with a plastic rod. There's nothing inside there, right? There's no ink in there. Uh, the little wings for, that act as the spring stop. And then here is the, the metasil part, the metallic pencil part. And this is just a little shaft for mounting it to the plastic. Operation is very simple. Just put in like this and it works just like a retractable pen and it writes similar to the other metacell so this is the light and these aren't sold as b or hb or number two or number one so you just buy the metacell and it is what it is and it writes for a very long time you know this does wear down to some extent but it never needs to be sharpened now let's compare the light to the normal Metacell. Very similar. Uh, so the, the material that is actually doing the writing, I don't think it's any different from one to the next. It's uh, you know some sort of uh, powdered metal. I think there's, uh, I forget what they said, some aluminum in there uh, and some graphite and sort of... Uh, pressed into this thing that lasts for a very, very long time. It's like an extended use pencil. If you go ahead and compare it to a normal pencil, in this case, we have a uh, Musgrave number two. It's a very standard wooden pencil. You can see the Musgrave is a good deal darker uh, so, uh, so number two or an HB, which is essentially the same as number two is darker. That means this pencil is something like, uh, an F or like a two H. So when it comes to writing with the Metacell light, I would say it's basically very similar to the Metacell, at least as far as the, the, uh, lead or the graphite goes, you can see there's two are both there and they're quite similar, uh, about the same level of darkness from one to the next. Uh, here's an HB for comparison and a number two. It's very similar. Those are definitely darker than the Metasil. Now we get into a 3H and a 5H. And the Metasil is more along the kind of the, the darkness of like somewhere around that, the 3H or the 5H, depending on the brand. You can see the Metasil 
you know, it's fairly legible on this white paper, but you don't have the darkness of an HB or a number two or anything in that kind of B range. Uh, it's definitely the equivalent of a harder pencil. Uh, what you don't get is the, the thin little tip of uh, a standard wooden pencil in a 5H that kind of digs into the paper and sort of unpleasant to use. The Metasil has that hardness of a 5H, or maybe a 3H around there, but you have a blunter tip. So uh, you don't have as fine a point, obviously. Uh, and But it doesn't dig into the paper the way the normal kind of like these harder pencils do. So if you're, I guess, if you really are looking for something that's darker, uh, you know, like a 2B or 3B or something, even an HB, something that level of darkness, the Metacell is not going to be for you because it's a lighter pencil, but it does last a very long time. And it is fairly pleasant to write with just because it has that larger tip. As I noticed, noted in a, a previous video, I did drop a Metacell and I chipped the tip. That meant it had a sort of gouge in it and it was, I had to reshape it in order to use it, which was tearing up pieces of paper. That's less of an issue with the Metacell light, just because when you drop this thing and it weighs, you know, I don't know what it weighs, like 16, 17 grams, you're more prone to uh, hitting the tip and, and uh, cracking the tip than you are this, which is much lighter. This thing is, has barely any weight to it. And then uh, you can replace this. I haven't seen these refills for sale for the light, but it does seem to be replaceable with a normal Metacell. I've definitely have purchased that refill and it's like maybe six or seven dollars, something like that. As far as like using the Metacell light, this is basically a uh, very standard pen body. You know, if you got like a Kako, that K-A-C-O, or like Staples brand pens and things like that, you'll almost certainly have used a pen body exactly like this. Metacill just got went ahead and didn't put in that refill, the pen, you know, the ballpoint or gel refill, and they went ahead and just made a kind of custom refill with this metallicized graphite tip on the uh, on the front end and, you know, made this a little bit wider, and all of a sudden you have that, that you know, mechanical pencil type thing. Uh, so on the whole, I like the Metacill, and, uh, but I don't tend to use it a lot because I like my pencils a little darker. I would say if you're in the market for it, you want to try it out, I would recommend the light. It is uh, just as comfortable to use. It doesn't look as good. You know, the Metacell has this cool metal body and uh, has a really clean design. This one doesn't have as nice a design, has no branding on it, which may appeal to you. Uh, but you're getting all of the uh, functionality of the Metacell, just you're not getting, uh, you know, you're getting it for half the price, just something that's, you know, a little bit less fancy. I will note that this does not have an eraser. The other one doesn't either, but this one definitely doesn't. So that's going to be an issue if you want a pencil with an eraser on it. And here's the Metasil. We were just drawing that. And you can erase it. It just, you need, uh, you know, you need an extra eraser. So it erases fine. There's no real problem with it. Almost nothing left behind. You know, it's not perfect, but it's pretty good. Uh, so you will need an external eraser. Uh, but yeah, that pretty much covers it. If you're interested in the Metasil, then the Metasil Lite is a nice way to try it out for half the price. It's also, uh, I think, a little bit safer. This thing, you know, there's no tip protector and there's no, uh, there's nothing to put on here. There's no cap if you want to throw it in a backpack or something like this. This one is retractable, which is nice. So the Metasil is more for kind of leaving it at your desk and drawing or whatever. And the, uh, the light seems like the way to go for day-to-day -day use but I haven't seen the refill yet. So uh, you may have to just buy another one. So it's hard to say if uh, it's gonna be more cost-effective over the long run. But yeah, that's the Metasil Light Knock, I think is the official name. And it's the metal pencil that never needs to be sharpened. Thanks for watching.